Hey world, I'm Josh. I'm Lauren. And welcome to another episode of Let's Try Stuff. We're back on the booze. And today we've got Hangar One Vodka. Sort of loosely at uh, comedian Doug Stanhope's suggestion. I uh, heard him talking about vodka on his podcast and sort of his love for vodkas with a nice bottle. And I think he's right. This is a nice looking bottle. It turns out it's a kind of an interesting vodka. It's made with Midwestern grains and wine grapes in California in an old airplane hangar. Alameda, California, which I think is the same place they blow stuff up on Mythbusters. And hangar1.com, like airplane hangar and spell out the one if you want to learn more. Shut up about it. So the tasting notes are floral, honeysuckle, and Asian pear. Trying to keep these things shorter, so Lauren, what do you think? I never get the tasting notes, but I actually do this time. I smell the grapes. Yeah, I, I smell it, and I, I thought maybe I shouldn't have been told about the grapes so that I could be objective, but I totally taste and smell the grapes. Yeah, I don't know that I would have picked out that it is grapes, but knowing what it is. I would have definitely said fruit, for sure. Absolutely. I really like it. It's very pleasant. Uh, it burns quite a bit on the way down. It does. Not that I hate that. And I definitely taste the grapes as well, in the aftertaste and in the top of my palate. I like that it's different, you know, I don't usually go for vodka. Yeah. But this is, this is great. There's some sweetness in there, some yeah. burn. It, it's not your typical tasteless vodka. I don't see them um, advertising anything about it being um, distilled X amount of times. Uh, I think they're aiming to leave the flavor in there. I'm not sure that necessarily qualifies as a vodka, but whatever. It's a clear liquor that has some taste to it. Yeah. Yeah, lots of fruitiness, real tasty. Definite sipper. Mm -hmm. Not sure how it would work in my cocktails. You might want to use it. With some soda. Yeah. You, and maybe a vodka tonic. I don't know. Yeah. It would work great in that. Any sort of cocktail that might be accentuated by fruity flavors. Um, and I can actually smell. I mean, my sniffer is broken, but I can smell it. No, I really can. So. Like I said, trying to keep this short, I really like it. I highly recommend it. Yeah, it's great. Fits the bill for a vodka that isn't quite straight vodka. I wish the bottle wasn't so big. Like, look at this. It's huge. <laughs> okay, keeping it short. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and leave a comment. Tell us what to try next. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.